so you met this guy online and he asked you to come over t- to come to his place and of course you don't know him you just met maybe on a dating app on on social media and you've been wondering if you should go or you shouldn't because of course even if it's something that will make sense if it's a relationship that will actually turn out to something um more meaningful or more promising in the nearest future if you decline to go to his place he might just feel like maybe you're not interested in him or you don't trust him him enough to come visit him yeah so this is a question that has been um out there for a couple of um decades now and it has also brought um, a sudden end or halt to some relationship that could have ended in something um interesting this and more are what will be going on in your head whenever someone invites you over to his place now first of all um to help your consideration the number one question you should ask yourself is why am i going to his place if you're able to answer this question correctly it will help you to decide whether uh, you should go or you shouldn't because i wouldn't be telling you uh, to go neither am i telling you not to go but if you know your intentions and then know what you'll be going there to do um that will help you because if you know that okay i'm going to his place because i would just want us to have some good time together i want us to watch movie i want to maybe cook for him or something and then it will end there if you're very sure that okay you're trusting the person enough that it's going to end here i'm not willing to do any other thing apart from this thing that i just mentioned and then of course if you are able to forgive yourself if um the things get out of hand and maybe it didn't go exactly as you planned maybe he demanded for sex or maybe tricked you or seduced you or forced you into um, making love with him on that first day that you went to his house if you're able to forgive yourself if such thing happens when you visit him then i think you should consider going but if you cannot forgive yourself you cannot tolerate such and you want to go to the his place and uh, someone that you don't know that just invited you over you should just consider not going because there are chances and there is no guarantee that things are going to work out your own way even if he promised not to touch you even if he promised that okay it's just going to be a neutral um time out it's going to be a neutral um date together you both are just going there to discuss and get to know each other even if he said that there is no guarantee there is no um criteria for him for you to trust him that much that you're going to just go there and stay inside his own house maybe meeting in a uh, in somewhere more open should be um recommended and talking about open places for your safety i think that is the first thing to um do uh, for somebody that you don't know i think the first meeting if you're going to be going to his side first because um i would suggest him coming over because of course he's a man he he's less vulnerable than you and he can be able to protect and um, defend himself if something happens if he comes over so you inviting him to come over to your own side maybe you coming to a restaurant or an eatery close to your place is best for you so you get to meet there and then you know the kind of person that he is know if he is something that or somebody that you might want to have anything to do with maybe on subsequent visits you can now go to um, maybe another restaurant or open area close to his own place uh, yes uh, so at least you know the area that he's staying then maybe i think when you both get more comfortable and get more committed and start to um understand um each other at least to some extent know your characters and of course I, I, it makes more sense if the relationship gets going at least you have um few information about this person before stepping your foot into his house to avoid regrets